Donna Wolf from Nastasia.com. Today I'm going to show you how to crochet a V scarf. This scarf is a combination of a triangle and straight scarf all in one and is literally shaped like the letter V. I'm using one of Kristen Omdahl's beautiful 100% bamboo yarns called Be So Sporty. A portion of the proceeds from this yarn's purchase is donated to a very special fund called Project Kristen Cares, which helps victims of domestic violence. You can find more information on her website, kristenomdahl.com. You can find the written pattern on my website, nastasia.com. To begin, we're going to chain 202 and use a stitch marker to mark chain number 101. If you need help with the basics of crochet, please see my beginner crochet videos on YouTube. I like to use just a paper clip to mark stitch number 101. Next is row 1. I like to do an alternative double crochet by making a single crochet and chain one. Then continue on with just double crochet stitches until before the marker. At the marker, do three double crochet stitches in that chain. Remove the marker and then place it in the second double crochet you just made. And then continue on with doing one double crochet in each of the remaining chains. This is a little diagram showing what your scarf looks like now. For row two, we're going to turn our work and do one of those alternative double crochet stitches in the first stitch. And then chain one, skip one, and do one double crochet stitch. Continue this pattern of chain one, skip one, and make one double crochet stitch until before the marker. At the marker, chain one and do one double crochet, one chain, one double crochet in the marked stitch. Move the marker to the second chain. Chain one and do one double crochet in the next stitch. Here's a little diagram of that. Continue on with what we did before. Chain one, skip one, do one double crochet until the end. Row three, start with the alternative double crochet. Chain one and do one double crochet in the next double crochet stitch. Stop before the marker. At the marker, 
chain one, do one double crochet, one chain, and one double crochet in the marked stitch. Move the marker to that second chain. Chain one, and do one double crochet. Go back to the original pattern of chain one, one double crochet, in the next double crochet across. Here is what that V point should look like. For rows 4 through 10, just repeat row 3. Your V points will look like this. Now it's time to move to row 11. Start with your alternative double crochet and then just double crochet in every double crochet and space until before the marker. At the marker, make three double crochet stitches. Then continue on with the same pattern of double crochet stitches in every double crochet and space across. Once completed, cut and weave in all ends, then clip on a lightweight pendant, if so desired, for your V-scarf. To view this video in other languages, click on the closed caption link on YouTube and turn on subtitles. From there, you can choose from over 100 different languages. I hope this video has helped you. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel, check out the description or the info button of this video for more information, and please visit Nastasia.com for more tips and tricks on creative, self-sufficient living. <laughs>